All right. Okay, there's there's some stupid shit that we need to talk about because it's fucking stupid. Uh, I just watched on the Sci-Fi Channel of all fucking places. Um, Bill Shatner has this new show called like Weird or What or something. I don't know. It's stupid. It's really bad. Weird science. Basically, basically, but it's like it's like he. It's just like stupid shit. Like it's like it's just stupid. It pisses me off. Cause like there was one thing where it was like, uh, the solar flares, like the patterns of solar flares in the suns are like not normal anymore. Like I guess they were cycled in like a, a normal way. I don't fucking know. I'm not a damn scientist or scientist for that matter. But like some dude was like, I watched the sun for like ten years and. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's been staring. Ten at years! <laughs> I've wasted my whole life! I missed all of my son's <laughs> soccer games! <laughs> and like, he's, yeah, he's like, I watched the sun for like ten years and all this other stupid shit because it's a waste of time. I don't know. And, like, the, the, the way they, like, segued into this was like, they tell you not to stare at the sun, but this man's been doing it for ten years. And, like, he was just like, yeah, I stare at the sun. And, like, just stupid shit. But anyways, he was like, I've been watching the sun for ten years, and, like, I guess there's a pattern and a cycle of, like, how solar flares work. I don't know. But he was, like, like three years ago or something. I don't know. It might have been, like, 2007. I don't, I don't even know what year we're in. And, like, yeah, 2007. Yeah, that's, that's, the, that's the year we're in, right? Yeah. And, uh... <laughs> He was like, I discovered these, these like little blips like flying into the sun or something. And he was like really confused by it because like little blips flying into the sun, that doesn't make sense, I guess. I don't know. And uh, he was like, well, if something's a little blip on this little sun picture and it's flying into the sun, the sun is like the size of like my face, right? And the little blip is like, meh flying into my face, right? On my face is the sun now. Okay. And like that little blip is like quite apparently would be like bigger than the earth or something. So he was like, those aren't asteroids. They can't be asteroids or comets because they've set off the funk of the sun or something. And now he's just like, it's more of a groove. It's more of a groove. And that guy was like, those aren't comets. They can't be comets or asteroids or meteors or whatever you call them when they're in space. They have be aliens. <laughs> yeah. Was it, was it the dude? Was it the No, it wasn't there? him because he makes sense. This dude was just like... <laughs> this dude was like, yeah, it has to be aliens. Inter giant intergalactic starships are flying into the sun and causing a sporadic... Funk defying pattern depatternizer dude, in the sun. Dude, it's possible though. Like, what if? What they're if just they like, oh, okay, no, 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 no. Hold what on. If they're, like, what if they're advanced technologically, but they're dumb culturally? That's not, like, that's not a like, thing. You have to fly into the sun. It's a sacrifice to our alien god. Poltra. <laughs> <Ultra. laughs> it's true. Like, it could totally be possible. But that's not a thing, though. You don't have. Thousands of years. Oh, what did the I'm, Mayans do? I have some shit about the Mayans, though. This show is terrible. They sacrifice. This show is terrible. But like, you don't have thousands of years where you're just like, I'm an alien, and like you don't have intergalactic starships, all right? You don't do that. And then just fly into the sun. You don't do that. It's... All right. Anyways, another thing. The Mayans, though. But like, what about Death by Fire? We sat. We we did witch hunts, man. What if they were just like alien witches? Aliens that can use magic, and they sent them to the sun. This is the, no. Oh my God! Viking funeral. Alien Viking funeral. Alien Viking funeral. They just like had their. Did that happen in Metalocalypse? Didn't they like send someone into the sun? I think so. Like, I know they burned people because, like, I remember that episode. The Codpiece episode. <laughs> they totally burned that guy at his Viking funeral. But yeah. I swear, like, they put someone in a spaceship 
and sent them into the sun for Viking funeral. It sounds like that. Anyways, Metalopolis. <coughs> but <coughs> the mines, right? The mines are a thing. Everyone <coughs> understands that. Like the road to El Dorado. Yeah. And, uh, but the fact that, like, you know, everybody was like, 2012, the Mayans predicted the Mayan calendar, yada, 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 all this stupid shit. Speaking of which, we need to watch JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. I don't know what that is, but okay. It's something about it. My worst fears are Mayans and dubstep. <laughs> <laughs> I only saw that today, but it okay. Me. okay. But yeah, like, the Mayans. They had the whole calendar thing, they predicted the end of the world, and all they this called, other bullshit. They called corn maze. Yeah, like, I mean, I, I believe it to an extent, but, like, there's other shit that happens aside from that that coins my theories, or whatever the fuck. Coins your theories. Yeah, but Russell's jimmies. Whatever you want to say. But the thing is, with the Mayans, is they've already been proved wrong. The year that have we're they? in. Have they? Have they? What year are we in? Right have now. Have they? What year are we in? Right now, over there? What does the clock down there say? What year are we in? 1973? We're in the year that we weren't supposed to get to. So that should be, in its own, a completely good reason to decredit everything the minds have ever said. And in this stupid William Shatner show, this dude was like, Are the Mayans predicting a super volcano to erupt and kill the whole world? Are the Mayans the Mayans? We're still using their predictions in Doomsday Theories. How... How are you not infuriated? I was infuriated. I was so mad. I don't know. They're not a credible source anymore. They're not just like, yeah, those guys are still right, even though. But wait, John. 2012 didn't happen. The 2012, the twos were both upside down. We're really gonna have the world end in 5015. <laughs> Ancient Mayan hieroglyph. 